Pete, a good win for your team tonight. How pleased were you with the performance? Yeah, I thought we've had more flow in games until just now. Um, it's all about winning, you know, in these games. But Manchester make it difficult. That's where, why they're where they are and the results they've had. And I thought we managed it pretty well. But, you know, you always want more. And I think, I thought in the first period we had some really good opportunities to take control, but never happened. But, it, you know, we kept going. And I think we had more chances and they're going to start falling for those guys. You know, and it's, we're good defensively, I thought, again, as a team. Bouncy play well again, so yeah, it's good. That third line, Alderson, Bush and Wallace seem to be clicking all night long. How happy were you with their contribution? For sure, because we've got depth. You know, there's, there's four good lines and uh, they're all bringing something. And it just, once it all clicks, it'll be fantastic. It seemed to be a fairly open game until the third period. Your team really then took control and just really dictated the tempo. Was that part of the game plan to try and seal things out? I, don't, I just think that sometimes the game just takes control of itself. It's up to the guys, and I thought the third period they were way better. Um, I thought we looked like we wanted we were up for just taking the points, and I think we we're a bit we won a lot of battles in the third period as well. And I think that's a good thing going into tomorrow because it's going to be a game of battles tomorrow. It's a small rink, and there's going to be a lot of bounces going around, and we have to be in the right side. And I thought we'd done that well in the last period. Pete, thanks very much. Joined now by Storm head coach Matt Ginn. Matt, a tough loss tonight, but a spirited performance by your side. How do you sum up the game? Yeah, I really liked our first two periods. Um, second period especially, I thought we controlled play and were unlucky to just get one. And then giving up a, a tough one at the end of the second hurt. Um, preventable goal, didn't get a puck in deep, had chances to get it out, and that one hurt. And then I think in the third, that caused us to change our game for a little bit to start. They got one that um, could, I, yeah, could have been offside. I'm not sure. But either way, we, we started that period slowly, um, and then it took too long to get to our game. But... Um, it just shows against a good team like that, you can't give them second and third chances. Did a lot of good things tonight, um, but just got to take that effort into tomorrow at home and, and hopefully correct a few things as well, tidy some areas up. For two and a bit periods tonight, your team were really in there. Then towards the end, the Devils really took control, really had a lot of the puck possession. How frustrating was it to try and get the puck back and try and get yourself back in the game? Yeah, I think, like I said, we just changed our game there and kind of played into their hands. They played a smart period. Um, and we, we just didn't adapt well. We got away from it. And it's a it's a learning uh, learning opportunity for us, I guess, to show that can't can't get away from what makes us successful and um, have to find a full 60 tomorrow. Uh, there may have been three goals tonight, but Evan Weninger, not really much he could have done on those goals. How happy are you with his performance tonight? And so far in this season, he seems to be the real difference maker for your team. He's been great um, throughout the whole year, really. He's given us a chance every game, and tonight he did as well. Um, like I said, none of the goals were, were on him. Uh, second one there, that hurts. We, we had the puck on our stick, didn't get it out, and then a rebound just didn't didn't get into under sticks. And that was kind of the case, I think, in our house. We, we didn't do a good enough job getting under sticks and, and taking away those second opportunities, but he's he's been great for us. Lastly then, same opponent tomorrow, but in your building, what you need to do to address well, we know how you have to play in that building, and we just got to be more direct. Um, I think at, in the third there, we got away from it a little bit. We were holding on to pucks, and um, even in this rink through the first two periods, I thought we were, were direct and predictable and played fast and, and had them on their heels there, especially in the second period. And we just got to take that into tomorrow.